Yes, so finally the unexpected don't happen. Will the INEC chairman Yakub Mahmoud survive this? He and his accomplices only God knows because now waiting people they talk at the moment with that. Welcome, welcome back to my channel once again, Connect to React, where we discuss the latest happenings in Nigeria, be it politics or anything we got you covered with our daily uploads. Well, country people, I'm back again with another update regarding what is going on in this country. And like I said, only God knows if Mr. Yakub Mahmoud will survive this because even by the time you finish watching this particular video, there's no how you will not pity this ma. Just do well to stay connected to the end of this video to get the complete updates. And before that, kindly support this channel by liking this video as you are watching. And don't forget to subscribe today and turn on your notification bell so you never miss any updates. Well, it is no longer news that many Nigerians are struggling with the rising cost of living and economic hardship and to be very honest this is causing a lot of pain and frustration especially for mothers because if you see the way they were raining courses on yakubu <laughs> or more because these days even to get food is difficult due to the increase in the price of food items making it hard to meet ends meet and like i said i have a particular video that captures some of the emotions and challenges faced by many Nigerians. This economic hardship is leading to a feelings of anger, frustration as many believe that they are struggling to survive. And this frustration have boiled over into protests with many Nigerians taking to the streets to express their discontent, calling for change and a better future for themselves and their loved ones. Well, this is the video. Please leave a comment below. Share your thoughts on this important issue and once again, kindly support this channel by liking this video as you are watching and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Coming back shortly. Today is National Prayer Day in Nigeria and the team is caused by Mahmoud Yakubu, professor and chairman of INEC. May every cause pronounced upon Mahmoud Yakubu's head today operate in his life forever. May the money he took to rig the election be a reproach unto him and everyone else who benefited from the money. May he spend it on problems that cannot be addressed by money. May God Almighty hear the cries of Nigerians regarding this man and hearken to our voices. May every calamity suffered by Nigerians at the hands of Tinubu be amplified and multiplied in his household. May the tragedies visited upon Nigeria by his action be the stample in his household. If it pleases the Lord, may his prayers and all prayers on his behalf be as abominable before God. May all the pronouncement on his head by Nigerians and all the calamities to before him also 
be upon every single person who worked with him to subvert the will of Nigeria. From corrupt directors and commissioners, federal and state of INEC Nigeria, to crooked coppers and worked as polling officers and falsified figures or sabotaged the election in any way, to police officers and thugs who harassed, maimed and killed Nigerians in order to steal the voices of the people or to prevent Nigerians from voting, may they all partake in your calamity and will befall that will before Mahmoud Yakubu. Lord, hear our prayers and hearken to our voices in the name of Yeshua. Amen. Adedu to Balogun said, Woe to Mahmoud Yakubu, who call evil good and good evil, who put darkness for light and light for darkness, who put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Woe to Mahmoud Yakubu, disaster is upon you. You will be paid back for what your hands have done. Woe to Mahmoud Yakubu, who builds his house by unrighteousness and his upper rooms by injustice, who makes his neighbor serve him for nothing and does not give him his wages. Do not be deceived. God is not mocked. For whatever one sows, that he will also reap. Mahmoud Omo Yakubu, you have sown evil. You and your own bloodline will reap the evil you have sown. Cause Mahmoud Yakubu day. Victor Israel said, Mahmoud Yakubu, the INEC chairman for the 2020 general election, you will labor in vain. Sicknesses will take away all your sweat before taking you. The soil you walk has become a curse unto you and your lineage. The air you breathe has become a curse unto you and your lineage. Nefretiti said, Mahmoud Yakubu, as you denied Nigerians their choice on February 25th, may Allah deny you Jana. May sickness money can't cure visit you. May the calamity and hunger you forced on Nigeria visit your entire family to the seventh generation and remain permanently. Omoto Williams said, Cause be upon Mahmoud Yakubu Day, a special day to cause Yakubu. Today marks the one year anniversary of the day the Fort Lent and next chairman buried our democracy. A year later, Nigeria is in a hopeless state. Please pass Yakubu's message below. Yakubu, may you never find peace. Dr. Umar said, Dear Mahmoud Yakubu, for your lies and deception that made innocent Nigerians queue for days and weeks and struggle to get their PVC to vote for their future, only for you to switch off the RF portal on the very day of the presidential election, plunging the country into the darkness of suffering. May your days and years be filled with pain and catastrophe. Malam Jabir said, The only thing I can say today is that may Mahmoud Yakubu reap what he sow. God bless Nigeria. Edouard said, Behold the face of the man that sowed the votes of millions of educated Nigerians to the highest bidder. Behold the one who aided in taking Nigeria back to the days of our ancestors. Dear Mahmoud Yakubu, if indeed Peter Obi won the election, may it never be well with you. Kolap Onedu said, Dear Mahmoud Yakubu, may all you have labored for in life be wasted. Peace shall be far away from you. Your household shall never experience laughter. As you deny Nigerians laughter, sounds of tears and weeping is your portion and your household. He now copied INEC Nigeria. Tumba Edward said, This day makes it a year when Mr. Yakubu and the cabals of darkness threw Nigeria to the hands of one of the worst criminals of all times in the Nigerian history. Cause be unto Mahmoud Yakubu. Cause be to the cabals of darkness. Cause be on all that participated in the greatest haste and the darkness that befell Nigeria. Dear God, why are you so merciful? May this man, his lineage, and cohorts never find peace. May the causes of over 200 million distrust Nigerians locate him. So Allah said, Mahmoud Yakubu, may the sun fight you by day. May the darkness of the night be against you. May your sleep be quiet. May you wake up in sorrow. May your ears never stop hearing terrible news. May you live in loneliness. May help be against you. Afam Dilok said, May Mahmoud Yakubu find his prayers turned to sin henceforth. May his days be cut short, and his descendants wander aimlessly under the weight of his wrongdoings, forsaking blessings. May they be withheld from him, and may his legacy be one of disown disownment and condemnation for his sins. Amen. Queen B said, Dear Mahmoud Yagubu, if truly you received any material or non-material benefit to rig the 2023 presidential election in Nigeria, may you never live to enjoy any of such benefits. May incurable diseases that will incapacitate you be upon you. May all the sufferings and agonies that Nigeria and Nigerians are going through at the moment be upon you times 10. May you be forsaken by Allah at your moment of need. May you go through a disgraceful and shameful death. Happiness, Eric said, for turning off the RF, Mahmoud Yakubu, may God turn off your entire happiness. Your peace will be turned off. Your health will be turned off. Your finances will be turned off by sicknesses that money can't heal. Your life will be turned off in a very miserable and painful way. 
Thomas not Sankara said, Mamu Yakubu of Einek, you will never know peace even when you appear to be smiling. Cause be upon you your household. The pain and agony you cause Nigerians shall double for you in hell. The worst place in hell shall be reserved for you. You will have no joy the rest of your life. Dr. F. Young John said, Mahmoud Yakubu lied to Nigerians that INEC would transmit results from poly units to IREF in real time. He went to Chatham House and told the world same lie. May Allah visit him with sicknesses money can't cure. May all the pains and blood of Nigerians be visited upon him. Amen. Ovo said, Dear Mahmoud Yakubu, by the wrath of the gods, let misery be your constant companion. May shadows engulf your every step and misfortune cling to you like a relentless spectator. Spectre, as the moon wanes, so shall your fortune fade, and the fates conspire against your every endeavor. Let the echoes of this cause haunt your days and nights until the very fabric of destiny weaves against you. Murphy said, Mahmoud Yakubu will not die well. Peace and happiness will elude him for the rest of his life. For the rest of Mahmoud Yakubu's life will be filled with pains and sleepless nights. Has caused Mahmoud Yakubu's day. day. Bolanle A said, let me start early. Yakubu, the money you were paid will become a milestone around your neck. An illness that can't be treated with money will be your portion. Instead of generational wealth, generational tears, sickness and pain will be your portion and those that helped you steal from Nigerians. Yakubu, may the blood of every Nigerian that was shed because of what you did haunt you day and night. You will run when no one is pursuing. You will not know peace for the rest of your days. Thanks for staying connected once again. If you are yet to subscribe, kindly subscribe today and turn on your notification bell so you never miss any updates. Well, to be very honest, the reactions are more than that because people are not happy at all. The pain and suffering are becoming unbearable. The situation in Nigeria is undeniably complex and there are no simple solutions. It is crucial to acknowledge the very real struggles that many people are facing and to work towards a better future for all Nigerians and we hope that this video has shed some light on the current situation and the impact it is having on mothers in the country and not only mothers, the people at large and it is important that while the situation may seem bleak, there's always hope by working together because <laughs> we Nigerians can find solutions and build a brighter future for ourselves and our loved ones. So that is the updates that I have for you this time around. Let us know what's your take on this particular topic. <laughs> because like I said, this is an important issue. People are not happy because of what he did during the 2023 presidential election. Now see what people are facing because of the mistake he made during the 2023 presidential election and people are causing this man every single day look at what people are saying on the internet people are really causing this man and this entire family i'm very sure that in his next life hey, mr yakub he won't make the same mistake he made during the 2020 presidential election well like i said let us know how you take see the matter in the comment section and don't forget to like this video and share so that more people can watch thank you for watching I'll see you in my next video.